So if a boy by Tuesdays, which over Fleetwood, and another expected larger way following mm. to, to, to follow with us to Chesterfield on Saturday, I'm guessing the, the game at Chesterfield will be one that the players are relishing? Yeah, certainly so. Obviously, there's a lot of confidence in the camp, but no better feeling when you go away from home. and. You know the, the amount of fans that we take with us is, is terrific. The backing's been outstanding, home and away. But yeah, naturally the, the lads are looking forward to it. Um, you know Chesterfield, we know their strengths and what problems they will pose for us. Certainly high scoring at home. I would expect it to be a, a good open game of football. Yeah, on paper, as you say, certainly at home Chesterfield. Yeah. You know, look at a tough challenge. By all accounts, very, you know, very unlucky, obviously, not to get the victory on Tuesday with that with that late equaliser for Jelling. Yeah, they certainly were. Um, and although you know they started off really well, Ted Evans up front scoring goals. I've, I'm led to believe he'll be out with an injury for a few more weeks. But the two lads that are, are in at the minute are, are, have done terrifically well for them. They've got good wide players as well. So um, yeah, and and the other night three one up and comfortable, and then lose a debatable penalty and then a goal in the 94th minute so that will really disappoint Danny and his side um, but I'm sure they'll, they'll be you know, fired up for Saturday and, and ready to come at us but likewise as much as we know and are aware of their strengths and, and what they're good at you know, we've got to focus on our strengths and what we're good at and uh, you know, I'm confident we can go down if we put a strong performance and hopefully come back with three points.